At one power, you should get your best overall image in terms of sharpness, contrast, brightness, saturation. In fact, when you look at the sky inside of the scope versus outside of the scope, this is really sharp. It's like looking through a freshly cleaned window. Now I'm going to increase the magnification about halfway to five, and you'll notice the reticle enlarges because it's on the first focal plane. We can start to see the stadia and markings of the long range reticle come into view. Let's bring it up to 10 power, and we're looking at the peak of Mount Davidson over a kilometer away. Surprisingly, we didn't lose a lot of light. It's still pretty much as bright inside of the scope as it is outside of the scope. There is some chromatic aberration. I can see that is the purple fringe along the tree line as it meets the sky there. You can make out at near the bottom right of the Christmas tree there. That is a 30 inch tall trail marker sign, but that's a good proxy for an IPSC target at this distance, about 1400 yards. 